Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. If you're new around here, hi, I'm Madeline and I'm so happy that you're here today. Today's video, I am going to be moving back to my college apartment at IEPUI. If you don't know what that is, that is Indiana University, Purdue University of Indianapolis, which is quite the mouthful. So that's why we say IEPUI. Um, it's basically Indiana University and Purdue University's baby and they put it in downtown Indianapolis. So that's where I go to school at. I am a sophomore this year, majoring in exercise science, minoring in health psychology, and I'm also getting my certificate in personal training. I live in the Riverwalk apartments, so if you are thinking of going to IUPUI or you are already here and in the dorms thinking about Riverwalk, that is where I live. If you're interested in the Riverwalk apartments, I have an apartment tour. I will link it down below and you guys can check that out as well. I'm going back to the same exact apartment. Decorations are going to be the same, everything, so if you want to see what the Riverwalk apartments look like, that is a good video for that. I'm not going to be filming a second apartment tour just because same exact apartment, it's going to look the same. Doesn't need another tour on my channel. So basically, I am like halfway moving in today. I have to go up and get my COVID test. I'm going to move most of my stuff in today, and then I actually have to come home to teach musical choreography for my high school. Um, that's not going to be in the vlog. This is just going to be strictly a move-in vlog, but um, that's why this vlog is going to be split up into two days and I am going to fully move in tomorrow, which is Sunday. I think that is all I had to say for the intro. We are going to go ahead and make some coffee and continue with the vlog. the stuff <laughs> coming with me today this is all like my hang up clothes shoes hangers clothes youtube stuff hats um this just has random stuff in it and that's food back there um this is most of my stuff it's just like my toiletries and my makeup coming up with me tomorrow so hopefully this fits in my car i drive a volkswagen bug so we'll see <laughs> Alright you guys, you are a little bit not straight. There we go. Maybe oh, this is kind of an awkward angle. But hopefully you guys don't fall over. We are on our way to Indianapolis right now. I actually need to stop at Shell. You are shaking really bad. I probably won't car vlog long because this is gonna really bother me if the footage is shaky. But we are heading to the gas station and then off to Indianapolis. I don't really have any updates. I mean, I haven't done much this morning. As soon as I stopped talking earlier, I literally made a coffee and packed up my car. And here we are now. It's about an hour and a half drive. I'm leaving early, hoping I can get my COVID test early and move in early. Because I'm trying to leave the Indianapolis area by 11 or 11.30. I just made it back onto campus. I'm in our sports garage right now because our testing is in the natatorium, um, which is actually kind of cool. We have like an Olympic swimming pool in there and Michael Phelps is actually swimming in our pool, which is pretty cool. IUPUI fun fact. It is only 9.40 and my test is not supposed to be until 10. I'm gonna see if I can get my test done early so that I can move in faster and be heading home faster. We are gonna go get our COVID test I'm assuming it's negative. I don't think I have COVID. And then we are gonna go ahead and move all of this stuff into my apartment. I'm unpacking one of my suitcases to bring home. It's actually this big. It's navy blue, but it looks black on the camera. I'm gonna unpack that one because that one is coming home with me because I don't have room to put it in my apartment. So 
So it's 10.13 and I'm back in my car. They ended up being able to get me in early and I'm negative. So um, I'm good to go move in now. I live like three or four minute drive away from the auditorium. So we're going to go do that, unpack super quickly. Um, I think I have plenty of time to get back early. I might be able to even leave Indy before 11, which is really awesome. So we are going to go unload all of this stuff into my apartment. We're going to go do that. And I'll show you guys like a little overview of the apartment. But like I said earlier, the apartment tour is going to be in the description. It's already uploaded in August. So if you guys want to see what a four bedroom and Riverwalk looks like, go watch that video. But I'm going to go ahead and drive on over. I made it to Riverwalk. This is what the buildings look like. And I'm honestly really annoyed because they did not like clear parking for moving. Like I'm lucky I found one. My door's right there. Like I'm so lucky I found this spot because... When I moved in in the fall, like, no one was allowed to park on here unless you were moving in right now, and they just opened it up for parking. So, that's a little bit annoying. But, I found a good spot, so it's not a big deal. I'm gonna go ahead and move everything in. I'm gonna bring in a couple things and just make sure my keys work, because sometimes it takes a little bit for them to, like, kick on. Maybe if I unpack super fast, I can go get some Starbucks. Anyways, I'm gonna go into my apartment, make sure my keys work and everything, and then we're gonna unload. Here she is. I am back in. <laughs> Okay, y'all, I'm gonna update you while I mobile order Starbucks. That whole situation was stressful. Basically, I went to move my stuff in, my key let me into the building fine, and I got into my apartment fine the first time. I go in to go in a second time with another round of stuff, and um, I can't get let in. Like, I got let into the building fine, but my actual apartment door would not let me in. I'm making sure this is correct. Grande, light ice, two pumps of sugar free, light pump of half an hour, two pumps of sugar free. Swag. And so I had to call the RA on duty and said like, hey, I got into my door fine, but I, or I got into my building fine, but I can't get into my door now. And I just got in. So like, it's not like my keys weren't unlocked or anything. Our key is like our um, ID card, by the way. I don't have like a, a manual key. It's a scan key. And so he was like, well, it sounds like your scanner's dead in your door. And I was like, I have limited time. Um, I'm trying to get home because I have stuff to do because I have to choreograph musical. I didn't say that, but I was like, I'm like <laughs> rushing on time here. And so um, my roommate was in the shower, so she couldn't see that I was texting her. And finally she saw that I messaged her and eventually let me in and it was fine. But I like kept moving stuff in and would just put it outside my door in the hallway and um, sorry, sketchy guy walking by. Just waited for her to let me in and she eventually opened it. I got all of my hanging clothes um, hung up and I unpacked the suitcase that I need to bring back with me. And since it is only 11.15, I decided to get Starbucks. I don't need to be at musical until 1.30, so I think... I have plenty of time to um, like have lunch and stuff when I go because I'm starving already and it's 11.15 and I'm not going to go through a drive through because I don't want fast food. I want like decently healthy food at home. So I'm going to go pick up my Starbucks and we are going to head on home. I got my Starbucks. I ordered a grande iced coffee with light ice, sugar-free vanilla, sugar-free cinnamon dolce, light cream and light cinnamon powder. This is what I get when I mobile order because I am too embarrassed to order this in person. So, so I'm going to go ahead and drive on home. Quick update. 
I made it home. It is 12.40 right now. I'm going to make a quick lunch and go on into musical choreography. Um, I'm probably not going to vlog again until I do some more packing just because I want this to be like a move-in vlog. Like, I don't want to include, like, the other stuff I'm doing this weekend. I am going to eat lunch, go on into musical, and, um, I'll probably do some more packing later. But, um, I want to spend time with my family tonight, too, so. Alright, you guys. This, like, angle is super odd. Um, I'm gonna see if my camera stands up better if the tripod's like this. But, it is day two of moving back to my apartment. Um, I'm driving back up to Indianapolis currently. Um, there were no tears when I left, which I'm very proud of myself for because, um, for starters, I'm a big baby. just appreciate my family and being with my family and stuff. And so, like, I just get sad when I have to leave. My car is sliding all over the driveway. My driveway is like an ice skating rink today. I forget what I was going to say, but I just get sad when I have to leave now. But I like being independent and I like school and I like being on my own and like, well, I like taking care of myself and like cooking for myself and cleaning and all that stuff. But your girl just misses her family a lot. I'm gonna go ahead and drive on to Indianapolis now and I will update you guys when I get there. So I just made it to my apartment building again. Um, I didn't take any videos of me like driving on the road this time just cause I did those yesterday and it's the same exact view. So there's just no point, but um, I have a lot more stuff than I thought I was going to because I got groceries and stuff and like I forgot about my bed stuff like I didn't even think about having to have that in my car today and I have like Valentine's gifts for my roommates and I have Ian's gifts in here and yeah I have a lot more stuff than I thought I'd have another full car so I'm gonna go do that and then I will talk to you guys when I'm unpacking so it is a little bit after five right now and this is my progress. It is still super messy. Believe it or not, it has come a very long way. I should have showed you guys what that looked like um, before I started, but um, I don't know. I just wanted to give you guys a quick update. This set I got at Target and it is so cute, but um, I'm just going to continue putting things away and then I will show you guys when I'm done. So I just have like grocery bags that I need to take out and a crock pot sitting there. But other than that, she is all the way done. What this all looks like. I really need to vacuum. There's like leaves and stuff on the floor, but I am all moved in. So I think for the rest of the night, I am just going to take a shower. Because it is a hair wash night for me. Really need to wash my hair. It's really gross. And then I'm going to edit this vlog and have some dinner and just work on some homework. So nothing else very exciting happening. So I just realized that strand of lights is out. If you enjoyed today's video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. Leave a comment down below and subscribe to my channel. And make sure you hit the notification bell so that you don't miss an upload from me.